in my website there are a range of different elements integrated into it like PowerPoint Microsoft Word and I created my own videos of my client and I also have integrated videos from YouTube for my website I use a range of different elements such as Microsoft Word PowerPoint and I videotape my client doing tutorial videos and integrated videos from YouTube as well. The video I recorded looks like this. Today, class, we're going to explore division. And I simply upload it to YouTube like this. And to apply to Weebly.com, you have to use a YouTube tab and drag it down. And to apply the video, you have to double click and you type in the YouTube URL. So go to YouTube, copy the URL, and apply to the website. Just like this. I edit my video in Windows Movie Maker and apply to Weebly.com. Another one of my advanced features would be the integration of components using Microsoft Word. I create a multiplication table for my client students on a math portion of the website. To create this table, I just to inserted a table and I made the rows and columns from 0 to 12 to, for the students to follow along as when they need to access it. Another element that I integrated is a PowerPoint, and I use the advanced feature of hyperlinking without through the games, the review, and tutorials of the PowerPoints I use on my web page. This is an example of the input output table and how I use hyperlink. First, I edit hyperlinks. You edit hyperlink throughout the game. I did it so you can go to the next slide as you want to go to. Just to click the shape, all you have to do is click the hyperlink. So if you go to the slideshow. From the beginning, you can click onto the shape and it goes to the answer. That's how I use the hyperlink. So on and so forth. Click to move on. That's how I use the hyperlinks. And you edit it and see how you go to the answer. You can remove the link if you want to. Another one of my complex features is more manipulation on the HTML coding using the SS style sheet given to you by Weebly.com. On this style sheet, I changed the color of the title and background and made it a little larger. See, this is the style sheet that I use to make my font family bigger or larger and my background color green to be consistent throughout all the pages. On this style sheet, you can manipulate any template you want to, give them to you by Weebly.com. On the website, and the complex feature that I have is use of editable subregions within the uh, website. It goes to many subregions. Like so. This is how you create the subregion. You can add on pages and regions. Like so, by dragging and pulling back and forth. See now, my subject is over to the left instead of right here. For one of my advanced features in using Webly.com, I use the manipulation of HTML coding. In my economy section of my web page, I use the HTML code from W3 Schools to make a chart, and I added on two rows and I inputted goods and services, producers and consumers, 
and things of that nature into a web page.